Hey, pack leaders here, friends are protecting fans from facts. So we had quite a, uh, a lot of comments on the COVID-19 vaccine. Uh, so let's go ahead and read them over and kind of, you know, talk about it. So we have Mike right here. I, I don't know why um, I couldn't see him. So I'm going to approve all these um, comments from Mike and go so far. Because I, I don't know if it's just filtering things. I'm not sure. Anyways, let's see here. Uh, let's see. Look up Lambda variant if you think the delta is deadly yeah i heard about lambda uh, it's probably the next evolution of delta and there's probably gonna be lambda and whatever else is next after the lambda and we still haven't hit the results okay yeah today wasn't a good day either for me so um i i didn't hit it today today was a bad day um okay that's something else and oh health for review i think that's uh some of these comments here i'm not sure why Where's the one about the vaccine? It looks like someone was just like, "Don't do it. It's a, uh, it's a, uh, you be in, you're gonna be infertile and all this other stuff, right?" So, let me see here. Maybe it is on there. <clears throat> Comments. I guess they all went through. I think. Let's go ahead and find that that comment. Content. Pause. <laughs> We got Adriana says, "My love, for freedom. Just look at the ever-growing censorship and bigger than my fear for a virus which has yet to be proven to exist. The CDC, nor the WHO, nor anyone has been able to isolate the virus. Without that, how can anyone claim the virus exists? Look up Lambda variant. You think Delta is deadly? Ha ha. LOL. And let's see if I can see more. I think some of the comments, for some reason, they're uh, I don't know if it's something that's." Um, <clears throat> Censoring on my side, or I'm not sure. I don't see the other comments. I saw another guy who uh, said that um, that we should be careful about the um, the vaccination and all the other stuff. Here it is. Uh, no, that's not it. We had Billy. Let's check Billy Chang. No, it's not showing up. Uh oh, censorship. So what does it mean? Yeah, let me see. Turn off channel mute Billy hide information. All right, so let's see what we can. Uh, what YouTube is blocking here. I can't see it. I mean, I saw it, but then you know, um, maybe I'll pull out my email. That'll be better as far as the seeing this entire comment here because I can't see it all and it's not showing up here. So, hmm, if it's being blocked, what does that mean? Is it true? Um, kind of uh, point of view. <laughs> so let's go ahead and find my email here, and let's go ahead. There it is. Um, they are not vaccines. They do not work. They disable the nat natural human immune system of everything it has learned since birth. Depopulation, sterilization, autoimmune problems. Do not let them put toxins to your body. They want you dead, and they want the children dead. Okay. And then by the time your body and brain are constantly filled with and refilled with synthetic protein toxins, you will have a secret mindset left. Spongy form and I got vaccinated, so I guess I can't pronounce this. Um encephalopathy. Okay. So yeah, I, I have heard the um the other side that uh, of it. I mean I saw the the other YouTube documentaries on the controversy with Dr. Fauci being involved and he's trying to make money off of it and there there is no virus and uh, is the 5G network kind of thing and uh, and uh, the vaccination is called some kind of a COVID is some kind of control some kind of virus whatever so they kind of control your your, your, your your mind I mean and it could be true Right, like um, you know, like you kind of go down this this thing where it's like, okay, so we don't know what to believe in nowadays. You know, it's like, dude, what do I do? Like, do I get it or do I not? And is it real or is it not? And you know, kind of thing, right? So, okay, so I mean, I mean, you know, the the videos could have been fabricated in, in India and all these massive graves, and you know, and like, can I? I mean, there's AI now that can make it make you look like a president talking with you know voice synthetics and you can sound like it's it's totally it could be right and we don't know and it's, it's hard to know nowadays and it's like dude where do i go how do i decide right so i know that uh, i mean whatever you guys 
came across and learned uh, and and uh, it's just built a lot of distrust in our in our government racing right so that that um, that divide from within uh, in our country and so uh, so where do we go then I mean do we divide it or do we want to change it do we want to support it do we want to you know have someone else uh, or is it gone is it completely uh, at loss like there's nothing we can do but just to kind of hunker down and just whatever happens happens we're just gonna be in our forest and just do our thing we're just gonna live and survive until whatever controls and powers that be do whatever they got to do we're just not going to be part of that and just kind of fight as much as we can kicking and screaming until you know until we live our days kind of thing and uh, I, I agree i mean there's there's uh there's there's a lot of things going on in terms of uh, you know, a monetary system and preserving that dollar and our massive spending infrastructure bill and destroying the economy you'd say and uh, and our dollar and I mean I, I see it you know like Argentina destroys their dollar because they don't have the military to build the demand which they destroyed we're kind of doing the same thing but I kind of see that there's the other end where we can use that dollar as a weapon and we weaponize it and we created the demand with you know the gun and so if you're forced to use it you force other countries to use it that creates the demand now I kind of like noticed that in Roman Empire too they lasted for 2,000 years and they got so massive military and then uh, once they start losing wars and trying to upkeep everything it was just bigger and bigger that they couldn't sustain and then you know from within it just crum crumbled right so i think if we see our military fail then yeah i think we're kind of i'm with you kind of thing and and uh yeah we, they you know they want to enslave us and control us so that you know we you know they don't want us thinking right because we're gonna have our own uh, way of thinking that doesn't align with the government's interests and the powers that be and they want to get us all on the same boat to you know do the agenda that they have whatever that is right uh, so um, I'm not saying that you know go you know do what you got everyone to each their own if you decide not to that is your choice I'm not telling you to do it and uh, for me, I, I've decided to just do it. So um, I will let you know if I if I report to you that uh, my mind is being controlled and uh, and you know I, I got the snip snip anyway, so I, I don't plan on having more kids. So that's not an issue for me to be sterilized because I physically did that to myself. <laughs> uh, and then uh, what else um, is there? There's toxins. Do I have any? Uh, cancer or you know brain fog or something that i cannot do or become retarded and um and i start having some immune problems and toxins i will let you know i will i will report back okay uh and then i'll be the guinea pig um kind of thing take one for the team uh kind of guy and and if i do get covid and pass away well then you'll probably find out from somebody that hey you know I'm not making videos anymore or something okay um hopefully uh yeah I, I can i can serve in that way uh to to kind of go that route okay so anyways uh if if, if it is true uh, more power to you and if i'm tr right then more power to me uh and then uh, we kind of go from there because we kind of have to like throw it out there and talk about it right and because we all kind of like think one way think one way let's wait and see kind of thing and have i heard anyone or die, seen anyone die from the shot yet i haven't seen it uh i would say maybe my dad got a stroke from the from the vaccine i don't know maybe he was just old like everyone else who got the stroke i did hear from a nurse uh who worked in the hospital that a lot of old people were coming in uh with strokes and um heart attacks from the the vaccine um maybe um and, and they're just like hey maybe there's some link we don't know yet so we gotta kind of like put these pieces together so let's kind of like you know have the mindset that we're here to work together uh, i just appreciate you um telling me not to get vaccinated and i know you're looking out for me 
and uh, I appreciate that. And so even though like you're telling me to do something against it, I appreciate your concern and your your love and your wisdom. And uh, and I'm sorry I, I didn't take it. Oh, well, I already you know it was after the fact, so nothing I could do about it right now, right now, right? And if I go and went against your wisdom, then I would have the consequences that I would have to to make and and uh, and yeah, I'm gonna have to suffer those consequences for uh, for for taking that vaccine, right? And then uh, and vice versa in your way, where if if it is true, if it is real, and if it is, it was a fake virus, and you you should be alright. It was a real virus, and you're at risk too. And we will see, right? We will see. So if you get it too, and you're, you know, comment below. Let me know that hey, I didn't get vaccinated, and I actually did get sick, or I didn't get sick, and or I recovered. Let me know. Keep us updated. Okay. So pretty pretty interesting topic yeah uh, so let's go ahead and kind of look at this you know mike said to look at novavax and lambda let's see what that's all about so let's go google it right uh novavax is kind of novavax 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 ah, let's try that novavax new generation revolution vaccines okay all right, so is this like mRNA kind of thing or totally different? Matrix M, okay, nanoparticles, recumbent nanoparticles, okay. Maybe a different strategy, I guess, or a different approach. Smart, talented, dedicated, okay. Uh, Matrix M, okay. How, how, do I want to read about it? I want the Cliff Notes version. MBX COVID nineteen okay, so this is a new I guess a different brand I guess um, a recumbent nanoparticle okay technology okay, so it's not mRNA it's some kind of nanoparticle it contains full length spike glycoprotein the vaccine was safe and associated with robust uh data were needed re regarding the efficacy immunogenicity and safety of this vaccine in a larger population okay um, okay so placebo one to one 15,000 participants 14,000 were included per protocol 27.965 years and older no hospitalizations deaths were reported uh placebo okay and severe infection report and all which were placebo group inclusions 90% protection 89% protection and okay cool all right well we'll try that too if it, if it comes out to be a better one if uh, we're allowed to do it maybe you know I'll, I'll go wherever it takes um <clears throat> man what's the other one um lambda variant tracking star oh okay, okay so this is the next wave i guess tracking souls two south america okay lambda c13 The Delta variant ravaged from Asian community group in the United States, other variants Lambda, spreading rapidly throughout South America. Oh, okay, this is 20 Lambda infection relatively rare. However, in recent months, Lambda has become the dominant variant in Argentina, Chile, Colombia. And the strain has yet to gain traction. Lambda now accounts for less than 1% of all infections, but given its trajectory in Latin America, watch, watch closely. Uh, escape pathogenesis may help us prepare for eventual spread. Yeah, I think we're just gonna go wave after wave. Really, is man, I don't know, man. Until until we're all exhausted, until the all, until all the the weak are gone, I guess. But remember, it could be a fake virus, so we don't know. So on the shoulder, amino acid lesion. Okay, I don't know all this stuff, so I don't know. It's kind of going over my head because it's just like, okay, I don't, I don't know. Alright, anyways, cool, yeah, so, yeah, we gotta worry about that, too. 
COVID-2, uh, Delta, Gamma, whatever. Start in India. Okay. Alright, anyways. Yeah, I mean, all, all we have is the news and what we what they report is kind of what we have to see. We're not traveling to India to kind of look at the graves or maybe someone on YouTube has traveled to India to look at the graves and uh, see how massive it is and, and go, oh, hey, you know, this this is true. You know, this is it. And, uh, and then you can make the decision whether it's real or not. Um, or maybe they're just whatever. I don't know why they're dying so fast. <clears throat> So, uh, I mean, yeah, I, I agree that, you know, our media is, you know, could be biased too and is biased, you could say. And we have to kind of put all the pieces together, whether it be, you know, news media, mainstream media that reports it and also like some guy who traveled there and then they heard he's reporting the same thing to kind of confirm mainstream and non-mainstream to kind of go, okay, yeah, maybe there's something or maybe the mainstream says this, this guy says something a little different, um, kind of go from there and... What thing about video is that you can kind of see maybe their expression, their human that human interaction, and say, "Hey, I think he's lying." You told him he's like, you know, blinking and you know, all this other stuff, right? Um, and uh, I think it was more authentic to be able to see them through video, and uh, you could maybe see how they're reporting it. They're just like, "Oh, I'm not, I have to report this again. It's, it's totally fake, and I don't want to report this." And you could kind of see in their faces, right? And so you can make a decision based on what you see, and uh, some people pick it out, some people can't, and you know, and you kind of go from there. And so to each their own. I wish you all good health and wish you the best, and and um, and we'll keep talking. All right, talk to you then.